Hi everyone, this is Teacher Jabelle and I'm here to teach you about math. Our lesson for today is about ordering numbers. By the end of this lesson, all the students should be able to arrange numbers in ascending order and arrange numbers in descending order. First, let's look at some important vocabulary words. Ascending means going up. In ascending order, we have to start from the smallest number up to the biggest number. Example, let's start from 1 going to number 10. Descending means going down. In descending order, we have to start from the biggest number up to the smallest number. For example, we will start from the number 10 going to number 1. Let's review the symbols that we use in comparing numbers. This is the less than symbol. Less than means that the left is smaller than the right. For example, 2 is less than the number 5. This is the greater than symbol. Greater than means that the left is greater than the right. For example, the number 5 is greater than the number 2. Let's look at some examples. Let's arrange the following numbers in ascending order. Again, ascending means smallest to biggest. It's better to follow some steps so you can arrange them accurately. Step number one. Stack the numbers. Write the numbers in a vertical way. Like this. Step number two. Count the number of digits. The first number has six digits. The second number has three digits. The third number has only two digits. The fourth number has four digits. And the fifth number has five digits. Step number three. Arrange the numbers. Since ascending order should start from the smallest number up to the biggest number, we can look at the number with the least number of digits. We can see that number 42 only has two digits, so it should be the smallest number. Next, 812 only has three digits, so it should be next. We can see that 2819 has only four digits, so it should be the next number. 14,329 only has five digits, so it should be the next one. And the biggest number with, the six, with six digits is 610,315. Now the numbers are arranged in ascending order. Let's look at another example. Again, let's order the numbers in ascending order. It means smallest to biggest. Step number one, stack the numbers. Write the numbers in a vertical way. Step number two, Count the number of digits. Step number three, arrange the numbers. So we can see that number 42 only has two digits, so it should be the smallest number. We can see that there are two numbers with three digits. So we will need to add one more step. Step number four, compare the numbers from left to right. 
Let's look at the two numbers first. 812 and 819. Let's start to compare the numbers from left to right. 8 and 8 are the same. So we have to go to the next number. 1 and 1 are also the same. So let's go to the next number. 2 and 9 are not the same. Number 9 is bigger and number 2 is smaller. So it means the next number is 812 and the bigger number is 819. We can see that we also have two numbers with five digits. So again, let's compare them from left to right. 1 and 1 are the same. Let's move on to the next number. 0 and 4 are not the same. Number 4 is bigger and 0 is smaller. So it means 10,315 is next and the biggest number is 14,329. Let's look at our third example. Let's arrange the following numbers in descending order. Again, descending means biggest to smallest. Step number one. Stack the numbers. Write the numbers in a vertical way. Step number two. Count the number of digits. Step number three. Arrange the numbers. So we can see that the number 50 only has two digits. So it should be the smallest number. But remember, we have to arrange it from biggest to smallest. So let's put the number 50 on the right hand side. Step number four, compare the numbers from left to right. We have two numbers with three digits. So let's start from left to the right. Seven and seven are the same. Let's go to the next number. Two and two are also the same. So let's move on to the next number. Two and nine are not the same. Number nine is bigger and number two is smaller. So we have to put 722 first and 729 is next. Remember, we are arranging it from biggest to smallest. So the smallest number should be on the right. We also have two numbers with five digits. So let's start again to compare the numbers from left to right. Two and two are the same. 0 and 4 are not the same. Number 4 is bigger and number 0 is smaller. So we have to write 20,000 first and the biggest number is 24,000. Now we have arranged the numbers in descending order or from biggest to smallest. Again, here are the steps in ordering numbers. Make sure to write this on your math notebook. You can also copy some previous examples on your notebook if you like. This will serve as your reference when we have a test. Now it's your time to practice. Arrange the following numbers. Write your answers on your math notebook. Number one should be arranged in ascending order and number two should be arranged in descending order. Pause the video while answering and play it once you're done. Now that you're done, let's check your answers. Great job, guys! Today, we have finished studying about ordering numbers in ascending order and descending order. It was fun learning with you guys. I hope to see you all soon. Stay safe. Goodbye.